For many, Christmas is a time of joy and excitement. It embodies the act of giving and receiving gifts as a way to express love and appreciation for one another. But most importantly, it's a time of reflection and gratitude as we take stock of the blessings in our lives while also making time to spread kindness and goodwill. This Christmas was so special to us, and as we share some of our highlights, we hope that you can find joy in some of the moments we experience. We deeply appreciate your love and support, and we wish you a love-filled and prosperous 2024. Making a Christmas memory. I am currently on the road. I'm downtown. Um, we have a lot of running around that we're doing today, but the Christmas season has officially started and um, we've done quite a bit already. We've done a tree lighting um, at Town Center in Mount Pleasant. It's just the kickoff to the season. Um, we also got our tree and we got such a cute tree that we've never gotten before called the white i don't remember i'll just put it right here anyways we got our christmas tree we still need to decorate that and tonight we're going to the charleston place to see their let it snow event I can barely find the time to sleep Yeah, spend my time running around Keeping people pleased But this is my favorite holiday It's a chance to start over new Cause I missed you so I'm letting go We're currently downtown at the Charleston place About to do the snow experience but we're about 30 minutes to go. So people are waiting around for it to start. Maybe more people are gonna come. 30 minutes. Because it is sold out, yeah. It's gonna be downtown already. This is pretty cool. Charleston Animal Society. We just finished looking at all of the trees and the designs were pretty good. I had a favorite um, that was by the Charleston Conservation Society. And now we're about to go downstairs and do the Let It Snow experience and indulge in the hot chocolate and hot cocoa. So yeah. Give it back. And I was like, huh? Give what back? And then he said, my breath. <laughs> Your dad's being a hater, Taylor. Hello. Huh? Hello. 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 Taylor, your yeah. dad. Remember the Lobo said, Lobo said you don't compliment each other so well. Oh. So cute. Aw, thank you, Liva. We have cookies. Oh my we have cookies and a whole bunch of coffee, sweet treats. These are the good times with you. Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me. Hang by the fire and chill. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories, oh. And I've been longing to hold you close. Forget about everyone else. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories. Oh oh. La da da da. Oh oh. La da da da. Good morning. It's Sunday morning, and we are about to finally decorate the tree. But before I do that, I need to put my Christmas playlist on. And if you're anything like me, 
Then your Christmas playlist would be based off of this Christmas movie. It's my favorite movie. Favorite Christmas movie, I should say. And we're about to clean up the living room. We also have a photo shoot scheduled for today. I told you guys about that yesterday. I'm gonna play those carols that you love. We'll be singing all the melodies until the sun comes up. Please have a good time to you. the remote that we use and on off on all right so you guys we're doing our photos and this is candace and she takes the photos and she has the cutest uh little props oh my gosh baby you look so nice i'm loving all of this y yes he does no i'm kidding <laughs> Maybe like uh, solo music too. Yes, music gets the solo for sure. Okay. New Jersey. New Jersey. Yeah. Now, guys. We I just finished world. our photo shoot. I know, right? And it was amazing. I'll, I'll take one. <laughs> Guys, it's a mad pop up. Amara's recital day. It's December 6th no, and December 7th. December 7th and we're headed to the school. So no, we're waiting. December 8th. I think our no, Uber is no, no, here. No, no. It's the 7th. Seven. 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 We're right. Ubering there uh -huh. and grandma is here. Grandma. Look at her outfit. Fit check grandma. Oh, okay. Fit check. All right, the Uber is here. Let's go guys. All right, so we are on our way guys. Okay. Huh? I'm embarrassing. Everybody having a good day? 
Yes. Yeah. Got something to say, pretty lady? It's good to be in Charleston again. Yeah. yeah. As I said, mommy's back in town, and today's Amara's recital. And so we're waiting for it to start. It starts in about 10 minutes. Um, we're really excited to see her perform. And guess what? In two more days, they have another performance. So guys, Christmas is officially here, and we're just so excited. I don't know about y'all, but the holidays definitely gets me excited, as it equally gets me anxious. Oh, some of the people are coming in now. The show. Man, the show was so Three. good. I thought you were open the act. <laughs> I there, first of all. The finale. in the opening act. That's what I'm saying. I thought it was so good. <laughs> 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 it was good for you for a minute. Oh. I mean, it had to be good. That's a whole umbrella. Good morning, people. It's the next day after a Mars. Did she wrap her in any box? And now we're downtown. We're about to go walking oh, at wow. the batter. It's a nice Charleston morning. Yeah. We're walking, looking at the Charleston battery right now. <laughs> This is one of the beautiful homes here on the Battery. Construction. That one. Yeah. This one over here. Too. Mm -hmm. You know how much the these homes go for? Yeah. Oh, yeah. What are you thinking of the Christmas decor on the Battery so far? It's so pretty. Look at the tree upstairs. Oh, it's an orange tree, yeah. It is real? Of course it is. Lemon, lemon. Oh my goodness. Oh, it is beautiful. What do you say? Just take my picture, man. <laughs> this is the Edmondston Austin house and they do Christmas tours so you can see all the Christmas decor. 
I do not know how much the cost is, but I'm happy to look it up online and tell you guys. Site of Fort Mechanic. So named because local mechanics gave their services for much of its construction. Yeah. So it was originally a timber structure. We just left the battery and come in to get some stuff for food. Cause you know the Christmas, we have to eat good. So we're getting some Jamaican food. And we're here at the mini mart. Yes, bossy from the chicken. Catch the food that look good. Okay, we want a piece. Good. And are you? Remember my YouTube channel, so I'm putting you guys on it. Yeah? Okay. Hi. Oh, I met you the other night. Yeah, you don't need nothing. No, you don't need nothing. Okay. So you get your oval tea in there. Okay, you don't need to bring nothing from Orlando for you. No, this is everything I need. You see a good. Oh, really? Keep your cancer. Oh. For real? Yeah. All right, we come back for that one. Apparently, this is good for helping reduce cancer. We're gonna see how much that costs. They also have elderberry. <laughs> Okay. Music, I get bringed off. It's okay. It's okay. Music, where's Jetsy? <laughs> Music want the chicken, guys, and Music. he's so mad right mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. He he wants it, and I'm you telling him mean? stop you, yelling. You <laughs> the jerk chicken smells so good, and Music is really, really annoyed that he's not getting any. <laughs> so the list that you used to do for Christmas, you go and you get your new curtains. Yeah. What else? Um, yeah. You, you paint. You, you, sometimes, if you have money, you buy paint. If you have the money, you, you wipe down the house. You, you take soap and water, you scrub down the house and thing. Okay. But the house, you just clean, you scrub the floor, you sweep up the yard, you cut down the trees, what, what, what you to cut and different things. Mm. Mommy, what was your Christmas like growing up? What was your Christmas like growing up? Traditional Christmas for you, like the feelings, what would you explain it as? Silence? No, 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 think, no. What was it really like? I tell her that what I experienced back home going for Christmas, I love Christmas because my grandmother, when my grandmother got to the store and buy the material to make curtains for the windows. Mm -hmm. She buy the new aluminum for the floor. And if we got money, we buy paint, and we got we scrub down the walls. And make sorry, they make black cake, they, they kill the pig, they do dough fork and kick cook peas and rice and rice and peas was peas and more peas and rice because <laughs> them shell the gungo peas yeah because yeah, yeah, we yeah, shell the, the, the pigeon peas that's part of the and then we have gungo that. peas gungo and, peas yeah <laughs> and then we have that and then christmas eve night people come along with their banjo the men them drinks ping the banjo and sing all christmas folks christmas songs mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so i was saying i didn't get to take you hilma when we were there but for Christmas Eve, we have Grand Market. I just remember going yeah, to I'll stuff like that. that. I didn't do it a lot, but maybe two times. Jamaican Christmas is similar to, you know, there. People buy new curtains. New curtains. You well, know what she just said? Hold on. She just said, remember mm -hmm. when people used to put up curtains? Mm -hmm. And it's just that like a string on it used to use, like a metalish string. Yeah. And it, it, it's like a, it's a, it's a metal kind of... It's, it's stretchy. It's a, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. So you can either, you, you can stretch your feet, yeah. basically. Mm -hmm. So you might have a one yard one, but your window uh, width is like two yards. So you have to stretch it. So you stretch, stretch and it. stretch all the way up. But sometimes mm -hmm. you come back and slap you, see? Yep. <laughs> <laughs>
We have flowers and we are officially rolling out on time. Talk up to us people. We say 5.30. Yes, I know this says 5.40, but it's 10 minutes fast. So we are on time. All right, let's pray up the thing. All right. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for life. We thank you for waking us up, Heavenly Father, because we know with each waking day that we have a purpose, Heavenly Father. We pray that our purpose is aligned with your will, Heavenly Father, so that we make a walk in your light. We pray that you guide and protect us as we go out to the Heavenly Father to see the hard work that these girls have put in. Heavenly Father, we thank you for them because they are blessings. We pray that you let them shine, Heavenly Father, and let them be all that they could be, the Heavenly Father. We thank you for everything you're doing. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. 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 And Please we are all prayed up and Bluetooth ready audio. to roll. It's about a 30 minute drive yes. from where we are. Bluetooth and audio. Um, the doors open at 6, so we wanted to leave exactly at 5.30 so we could get there at 6. I probably showed you guys earlier where I made our own reserve seating signs because I was there. And why not? Um, you know, we have four reserve seats right now. So stay tuned and see if our reserve seating signs are still there. And if it's not there, it's not a big deal, right? It's not my event, but it'd be nice if they were still there. It would be very nice. And I would low-key feel accomplished. Wouldn't, wouldn't you feel accomplished? That we have good seats that your wife reserved. Yeah, I feel good. I didn't do it. I feel good. I definitely would be glad I would. But you know who asked me a hundred times already if I check if they're there? This person right here. She said, call and check. But you know she so wants good seats. But well, you know what it comes to with love Yep. Yes, that's what she was saying. She's used to getting to the event early and saving seats for everybody. Definitely believe Trust me. I know sometimes people ask me why I wear shades at night, but it's a Jamaican thing. Yeah. Or maybe it's a Caribbean thing. It's just cool. It's a superstar thing. It's a superstar thing? Yeah. So then, Caribbean people have always been superstars. Mm -hmm. Yep. When you shine, and you need something to block the sun. Even at night? That's what they're saying. They should wear shades on the wood that you do. Alright, guys, we'll see y'all there. <laughs> Alright guys, we're here and we're getting ready to get started. We're about to take tickets. That's my host today, so I'm standing here with the line. There's a bunch of people that's lined up. Hi there!
My name is M to the A to the R to the T to the H to the A, S to the L to the A. You want to know why? Because I slay everything and everyone in my way. What's my name? Mother Slay. that we had so much to do today and the holidays are in full swing. I'm currently trying to um, fix up the living room a little bit. I'm fixing up the living room. We have sorrel to make, Christmas rum cake to make, all of those things. So um, my mom and my mother-in-law are here and they're obviously going to help me with that. I don't know guys. I feel like during the holidays there's always so much to do and the to-do list um, just never feels like it's ending. And I probably, well, one of the very reasons why it feels like that is because I need to write down my to-do list. It's all in my brain and I feel like I'm driving myself crazy thinking about all of the things that I need to do instead of putting it on paper, so. Also, it's December 13th, and I have not even shown you guys my Christmas decor yet. Like, what the hell is happening here? I need to get it together. Oh, I need to get it together. So once I get the tree done, which my hope is to get it done by tomorrow, which is December 14th, yes. I'm super late, though I had my tree almost a week and a half ago. In my defense, the tree is beautiful without any decorations on it. I'm just forcing to put decorations on it, and I really shouldn't be. All right, let's make, let's get started on the sorrel. So we're starting with the sorrel first. We have our ginger. Mommy already peeled them for me. about it. Say please. You Grandma come in the house and it, don't bring nothing to you. Did any work from morning? Did any work from morning? 
You're doing the work from on in, but you want food. <laughs> you see, you don't have to do a lot. Just make the water boil and then you turn it off. I just had to run to the store because I couldn't find my mixer. I really don't bake a lot, so. The last mixer we had, the last time I saw it was when we were packing to leave New Jersey. The last time I saw it. All right, guys, we're gonna get into the baking. Who wants to see the baking? I'm sure you do. Okay, guys, so how to bake a Jamaican rum cake. This is gonna be an amazing video, so make sure you keep watching. Step one, you need to soak the fruits, okay? So the fruits, this has been soaked for about, Mega just said two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> two weeks, but some people soak it longer than that, okay? Thank you. Mommy, you want a shot of white rum? A shot of your white rum. <laughs> Okay, so we're done with the blending segment of the cake, and so I don't remember what step we're on to at the moment. But whatever step we are, the next step is to mix up we got a mixer. the butter, the sugar, and some eggs. Yes, Taylor, this is the best part we where you get to egg. taste the butter with the sugar. Ooh, can I blend it? My favorite Can part. I blend it? Yeah, of course. Well, no, because you're sick. Go oh. away. Go away. Yeah. You're ready, ready, ready. Get some <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. All right, let's go, Blendisha. <laughs> it would be nice if we know how to use it. These are the good times with you. Baby, this year it's just gonna be you and me. Hang by the fire and chill. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories, oh. And I've been long to hold you close. Forget about everyone else. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories. <laughs> 